hospital she had had a surgery and for seven days she had intestinal obstruction there were loops water loops of the large intestine and the small intestine showing that both were obstructed and they were getting her ready for surgery a second time and we went to pray for her on saturday night i heard the lord's voice saying if she is operated the second time Additions will become worse. It will be a terrible complication. So we prayed, and Saturday, Sunday I kept asking, "Has her bowels open?" Sixth day, no bowel bowel motions. We kept praying. Jilani also went and joined with her sister and prayed. At ten in the morning, on Monday, the operation was due next day, ne- next that evening. Seven days, nothing by mouth. intestine obstructed she was on saline and an isogastric tube uh, at about 10 in the morning her sister saw two huge hands she said this morning very very fair hands went into the bowel and moved the bowels around the sick person was asleep after 15 minutes the sick person woke up and said i want to go to the toilet and she went and passed everything no operation sent home next day we will give a hand clap to jesus <laughs> one more miracle you know in, uh, in we have been uh, concerned and sad that uh, rex uncle has been so ill yeah, and he's now well but still not back to normal strength and uh, he had a healing meeting on wednesday every wednesday in 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 shanti's church he had conducted a healing meeting and now a recent convert his name is lester his w- wife's name is ajanta he drinks as much as rex used to drink i mean drink meaning alcohol only thing he shouts more than rex shouted rex shouted but not as much as this man while a brawler got gloriously saved and he's doing the healing meeting what do you think he's acting just like rex telling people to get up walk nobody has taught him he has so recently come to the lord so the other day just at the time just just before the time in uh, mahal wasil the other day uh, he he had a relative called elsie went to her home because she was uh, having rheumatoid arthritis and a skin eruption all over her forearms both sides this lester and his wife went and commanded healing instantly the hands opened up and the eczema disappeared as they saw it and this brought great faith and elsie said i have to go and see your pastor now itself so it was 9:30 in the night that's the time on a sunday night pastors like to rest she comes to nishanta's home saying please uh, i have a relative he is being treated with chemotherapy in maharagama cancer hospital he has leukemia he is not treating anything many days he has not eaten anything he can't drink anything he is vomiting will you pray so nishanta prays Then a call comes from cancer hospital saying he is dying. Come immediately if you want to see him alive. Elsie says, "No, we are not coming because we have just prayed, and he is going to get healed. Tell him we are not coming. He is going to get healed." Again, the relative says he is going to. Please, you know these eyes. No, no, we are not coming. Tell him he is going to get healed. Four hours later, a call comes saying vomiting stopped suddenly. He is asking to drink. Next day he ate. Four days later, discharged hope. Let's give a hand clap for Jesus. And this morning there was such a healing anointing. I asked people to stretch their hands forward and ask for the gift of healing. Praise the Lord. Will you do the same thing? Ask for the gift of healing. These are days Jesus is walking on earth one more time. Catherine Kuhlman always believed. just before the coming of christ there will be a mighty revival of healing ministry will you say amen, amen. mighty miracles organs reappearing god doing mighty miracles praise the lord praise the lord god doing mighty miracles you know i just recall this our wednesday healing meeting 
Wednesday evening, Wednesday, uh, 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 when we began the morning meeting, we first began with the Wednesday morning meeting. A lady came. She was being half. She was being treated for cancer, and her hair had dropped. She was seated on the chair. And her name was Mrs. Harold Pereira. I used to sing along, and Manju was there at that time also. And we made a great team. You know how well we sing, and we were singing along. No music, and suddenly the Holy Ghost fell on this lady, and she fell off the chair. Then I went to help her to see. She's speaking in tongues. Then, then I realized she had got born again, seated on the chair, got baptized in the Holy Spirit. Cancer disappeared. Shall we believe like that? Yes. Baptism in the Holy Spirit returning. Praise the Lord. Glorious Lord. We need a song to capture the healing power of Jesus. What shall we say? Koramarandi Vyalabhati Kirmandi Kirbarandi The healing the healing in his house is good, but it's a little, little, uh, little real violent healing song. Can you see this to some? No, but healing. There's a healing. Okay, we'll sing healing in this house. Yeah, healing in this house. There is healing in this house. There's healing in this house. Praise the Lord. There's healing in this house. Praise the Lord. There's healing in this house. There's healing in this house. Healing in this house. There were two words of knowledge. One was no gloom, no fear that impending sense of disaster is not coming. It's God. 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 Korbandi kirabandi ikalamandu kohorabandi rialabandi. There's healing in this house. Kirabandi rialabandi. Lord, we are asking for healing anointing. Healing anointing. Ask the Lord to touch your body. You may know what you have. There may be things that you don't know. But the Lord for the body. Will you say with me, Lord for the body. That's the healing anointing. It's wonderful when the healing anointing floods the house. Great hope arises. Your body is renewed. Your youth is renewed as the eagle. You have unending strength. Anointing gives you strength. Anointing makes your body fit. Anointing makes your bones to work very well. Anointing touches your bones. He crowns me with loving kindness and tender mercy. Receive healing for yourself. Someone might have said you have a fatty liver. Let the healing race. Healing race. Go through your liver. Kalamando Korabarande. Igamandu Riala Barandi Riala Bande. There is healing in this house. Healing in this house. There is blessed peace to come. Restoration in this place There is mercy, there is grace So all you heavy laden hearts Come and bring your burdens one by one You can leave me here and they belong There is healing in this house there is healing in this house, healing in this house, there is blessed peace to come, your troubled hearts been healing by, there is healing in this house, restoration in this place, there is blessed 